After I left Starfleet, I made it my life's work to reunite the Romulans with their Vulcan brothers. For many years, I lived among them and waged the campaign of peace. Live long. 21 years ago, the star of the Hova system went supernova and sent a wave of devastation across the quadrant. I promised to save the Romulan homeworld. I failed. The planets Romulus and Remus were destroyed. Countless billions were killed. My home, my friends, my life, all are memories. Time does not stop for one man, and neither does history. The chaos in Romulan space gave the Klingon Empire an opportunity to expand its territory. Jim Pak, the Chancellor of the High Council, traded diplomacy for the tip of a blade. Only in battle, Jim Pak says, is a Klingon truly Klingon. The Federation did its utmost to preserve its alliance with the Klingons, but war was inevitable. Romulans want revenge for their lost world. The Dominion is rebuilding its forces. Now the Borg have reappeared, and the Alpha Quadrant balances on the edge of ruin. The fate of the galaxy rests in your hands. Well, then the galaxy's fucked. Finally, I was beginning to think you forgot what today was. How could I? You've reminded me every day for the past month. Did you get your assignment? Of course, I was first in line. Oh, before I forget, I think Rasky is just ahead. He wanted to thank you for helping him cram for the astrometrics final. Hey, how's it going? Wow, you are fucked. There you are. I wanted to thank you for helping me pass that final. And for all the other times you've helped me. I've always admired you. I hope Starfleet recognizes all you've done to lead our class. What ship did you get? Well, to be honest, I haven't received my assignment yet. Good luck. Before Thanks. you report to Lieutenant Farah and get your assignment, you should find Tavral. She wanted to talk to you. She's just up the pathway. Okay, thanks, fella. Greetings. Hi. It was good of you to encourage me to retake the linguistics final. I was willing to accept my original results, but you saw that I was not at my best that day. My score increased by 12.8% on the second attempt, well within my standard norms. Now I am qualified to serve as both a science officer and a communications officer. Morik would fantastic. like to see you as well. He oh, is okay. ahead of us on the path. Live long and prosper. Ditto. That's what it's all about, guys. It's what we're fighting for. Oh my God, Smurfs. There you are. Hey. Getting excited yet? Once no. we finish our training crews, we'll all be full-fledged ensigns. The buzz is, Captain Taggart hasn't named all of his senior staff yet. From what I heard, the advanced phaser training simulation is tripping people up. Wow, that sucks for that. Hello, I did not introduce myself, cadet. I am also a cadet. Uh, Butters is the... Excuse me, I'm just going to slide right in here. So, uh, what are you doing after graduation? Do you like uh, going out? Having a cold one, perhaps? Mm -hmm. Well, you just let me know. Oh my god, I love Starfleet. The fuck is that? So, uh, what are you ladies doing? Oh, what is that? Use the hypo. I can do that? Just injected myself with a needle. That can't. Hello. And how are you? Yeah. Oh. Okay. I mean, the pathway's right there, but that that that's fine. You can. That's cool. Hello. What the 
fuck are you talking to? God, they all have mental illness. We, hello. How are you? My middle name's Riker, by the way. Just thought you should know. Come. Cadet Butters reports as ordered, sir. Cadet. Uh, you asked to see me, sir? I did. I've been following your progress here at the Academy, and I must say, I'm impressed. Well, thank you, Captain. I'm just looking at your final test scores, but I don't see your results for the advanced phase of training program. Uh, many of my classmates didn't take the test either, Captain. Is that an issue? I want everyone on my senior staff to run that program, and I want to see good results, no exceptions. Um. Did you say senior staff? I did. Like I said, I've been following your career here at the Academy. If you complete that program, I can put you on my bridge. I'll ask my tactical officer to set it up. Your tactical officer, sir? Who is that? Another fine cadet like yourself. Her scores were almost as good as yours, but her record has a few blemishes. Still, I'm sure Cadet Flores will settle down and become a fine officer someday. I'll tell Flores to meet you out in the quad. Talk to her to start the phaser training, and I'll see you when you're finished. You're dismissed, cadet. Yes, sir. Center of the room. All right, we gonna shoot some Klingons or what? Brr. I don't think I'll ever get used to that. Press the R2 button to fire your weapon in oh, combat. Shit. Good. Captain! Well done, cadets. You're not gonna break the Academy record, but your score was more than satisfactory. Thank you, Captain. You have an assignment for me now? Absolutely. I have a new first officer. Congratulations! First officer, sir? Yes. You should be proud of your accomplishments here, cadet. You have a promising career ahead of you in Starfleet. Thank you, sir. It will be an honor serving with you. Holy fuck, did you hear that? First officer, way to go. Just a little jealous, I'll admit. <laughs> At least now you'll get to boss us all around like you've always wanted. No, <laughs> what can I say? The captain sees Don't greatness in me. Don't let it go me. to your head, buddy. I won't. You'll do great. <gasps> but we should head up to the shuttle bay. Everyone else is waiting there for the ceremonial send-off toast. Okay. Senior staff is waiting by the bar. I'm sure everyone's a bit nervous this being our first real assignment hall. I hope the pilot's so, not there. So I'm expecting an inspiring speech out of you. Something heartwarming. Make Tavrell <sighs> cry. This mission could just determine the rest of our careers. No pressure. I'll meet you over there. Great. No pressure. No pressure at all. I gotta give a goddamn speech. Fuck. I need a shot. This is some fucked up shit. God. Uh, ha! Be humble, I don't know. May I have everyone's attention? We are the senior staff of the USS 1071. Each and every one of us has trained for the task at hand. 
we are ready. I have the utmost faith in each of you. You're the best the Academy has, and together, we can do anything. But we will go forth boldly like Starfleet has trained us, putting to use everything we've learned here. To Starfleet Academy, to the USS 1071, to her crew. All cadets, please board your shuttle. All right, time to go to work. God damn. No more drinks for you. Are you ready to head to the ship? Fuck yeah, let's go. I know, right? Oh, look at that. The USS Vesta, the first of her class. She's got subsystem targeting, a crew of 750, auxiliary phaser cannons, and even a quantum field focus controller. I can't wait to captain one someday. But here's our ship. Well, you gotta start somewhere. Miranda class, 200 crew, two forward weapon mounts, one aft. Average speed, warp 5 point nothing. She's a tough little ship, though. I think I like her. We're the final shuttle to arrive. We need to get to the bridge. Hello. Name and position? <laughs> Whatever position you... Oh. Uh, Cadet Steve Andrew, acting first officer. I have your record right here, sir. You can Welcome call me Butters. Uh, where's the captain? Captain Taggart is waiting for you on the bridge. Use the turbo lift behind me. It will take you directly there. Fantastic. Thank you. Da -da 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 -da. Holy shit, this is awesome. I hope Q doesn't show up on my first day. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. Welcome to the bridge, number one. Number one? Early in my career, I served with a captain who called his first officer that. I always liked it. As my number one, I expect you to ensure my orders are carried out and to advise me on the best course of action in any situation. But first, we need to get out of dry dock, get clearance from control, and close the shuttle bay doors, then disable the tractor moorings. Okay. Earth traffic control has cleared us to depart, sir. Fantastic. Very good number one. Shuttle bay doors are closed, sir. Very good number one. <laughs> yeah, I'm on point. Potter, wait for me to disable the tractor moorings. Oh, yeah. Please, tractor moorings. Uh, those should be uh, over here. See? I remember. I remember. Like a boss. Alright, everything looks on point, sir. Potter, take us out. One quarter inbox. Uh, Captain, may I remind you that Starfleet regulations specify thrusters only while in the vicinity of space dock? Just checking to see if you were paying attention, number one. Potter, take us out. Maximum thrusters. To sit, press the X button while targeting the chair you wish to sit in. Oh, yeah. From dry dock, Captain. Good. Let's start with something easy. Set course for Vulcan. Course lead in, sir. Engage.
So what can I say? That was the second time I got thrown Captain, out of the bar. I am picking up a distress call from the SS Breakeven. Audio only. Let's hear it, Tavrell. This is the SS Breakeven. Our fourth Sounds like a Ferengi. And we are in need of assistance. Let them know we're on our way. Potter, lay in a rendezvous course. Altering course, sir. ETA three minutes. Transporter room. Prepare to beam over survivors. Sir. Sensors can't read anything in the vicinity of the break even. Communications are out as well. Keep trying to hail them, Tavrell. Number one, let's discuss the situation. You heard the distress call, number one. What do you think we should do? Is this a test, sir? Part of the training cruise? Absolutely not. We're the closest ship to the break even, so it's our duty to assist. Strange that the transmission was audio only. A uh, warp core emergency shouldn't affect communication. Good. What do you advise? Hmm. Yeah. Well, I think we should go shields up, sir. Better safe than sorry. Raising the shields does seem to be a reasonable precaution. Yes, sir. It could be a trap. It's a trap. I agree. Lawyers, raise shields. Number one, get down to the transporter room. You'll oversee the rescue effort from there. Aye, sir. Break even should be in range. Give me an update, please. I'm getting some weird readings. Uh, I can't get a solid lock. There may be interference. Trying to compensate. I think I have it. This is a lot different than the training scenarios. Beaming them over now. Hang on! This vessel is now property of Captain Kata of the IKS Chalk. Da, 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 da. Right, come in, what happened? Right. Doc, security is reporting to the fire in the transporter room. And Klingon transporter signatures are showing up all over the ship. They're boarding us. What can I do to help? You have the command codes to unlock an armory near your position. Arm yourself and any security team members you find. What about the enemy ship, sir? We still have weapons. I'll do what I can. For now, I need you to concentrate on getting those Klingons off my ship. Tag us out. Yes, sir. How the fuck, if we put shields up, did they fucking get through? Uh, yeah, I see, I see ya. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what? Oh, yeah, 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 I gotcha, I gotcha. Uh, 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 one, two, three, four, five. There we go. Sons of bitches. Oh my god. Healing, healing. Fuck. Number one, we're doing 
our best to cripple this Klingon Marauder, but I need your help. Time to show off that academy training. I know how to improve the ship's weapons. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 hey. Everybody, relax. Follow me. Oh shit. Press the right stick to crouch. Crouching gives a defensive bonus against ranged attacks, but increases damage from melee attacks. Well done, crew. Stand back and breaching. I said stand back. You fucking ass hat. Let's not bottleneck the doorway, people. Ugh, running it. Alright, let's see what we got here. Phasers. All right, I'm boosting phasers. All right. Um, what else we got? Uh, power up aft phasers. Okay, powering up the aft phasers. Those are online. All right, boosting the torpedoes. Good interrupt here, and the Klingons could send a boarding party at any time. I need you back on the bridge. Aye, right, sir. Go. Shit. No. No. Son of a bitch. God. Damn it, no. No. Are you all right? Hold on. I've got you. Yes. Who else is down? You're okay, you're sitting up. No oh, shit. It's Frel. Hang on. Incoming transmission from the Klingons. On screen. This is Captain Kayak of the IKS Chart. You may have forced my boarding parties off your decks, but our ship remains cloaked. You have no hope of finding us or defeating us. Your choice is simple. Surrender, or we will kill your captain and then destroy your ship. Anyone ever tell you you look like a penis? Perhaps your captain will change. Captain? Order your crew to surrender, Captain, or I will blow them out of the sky. It's your choice, Captain. Do you want these children to die? Very well. Number one, you are now the captain of the ship. Your orders. I don't want to be captain. We have target lock, Captain. Fire. signal what now uh. we we survived but the captain Cap 
Captain Taggart knew what would happen, and he gave the order anyway. Ultimate sacrifice. One that we all might be called to make someday. He trusted you to take command. All we can do now is survive. And remember him. Failing the break even now, Captain. The SS break even. This is the Starfleet vessel USS 1071. What is your status? Oh, um, hello, Starfleet. I knew it was a no Ferengi. Hard feelings, right? I had to send that distress signal. If I didn't, that crazy Klingon was going to blow my ship into space junk. And, um, because Starfleet's always ready to help and all. Uh, could you help me repair my ship? Uh, I'm grateful for all you've done to save my ship and cargo already. But the sooner I can get out of here, the sooner I'll be safe from Kaden. Uh, I'll see what we can do. Press up to increase your ship's speed. Son Press down bitch. to decrease your ship's speed. Use the left stick to pitch downward or upward, as well as to turn left or right. Oh yeah, they're leaking a bunch of shit. Helm, full stop. I've stopped us this time, sir, but from now on you'll be responsible for adjusting the speed of the ship. Looks like she just needs three or four warp induction coils. We have plenty of those to spare. Position yourself near the ships and press the X button to interact with them. Thanks! We'd help you if we could, but I just don't see any profit in that, you know? Well, Die. looks like we're on our own. Fucking At least ass. they said thank you, I guess. About that cloaked ship full of Klingons? Zarva, do you have that damage report? Almost done, Captain. Level 2 diagnostics shows that almost all of the plasma injectors are damaged beyond repair. Do you have replacements? Not enough. Plasma injectors are made to withstand quite a beating, but I think the Klingons specifically sabotaged them when they boarded us. It's an easy way to cripple a ship. I'm installing what spares we have, but we're short three injectors. Without them, we can't go to warp. Any ideas? We're not the first ship the Klingons have hit here. There's wreckage all over this region. I can scan the derelicts and see if any of them have intact plasma injectors. Do it. 